All right, so maybe you're in a situation where you're needing to mirror your iPhone, your iPad, or your Mac to a Roco stick. Well, in today's video, I'm gonna show you the step-by-step -step process in how to do this. Well, hey guys, Juan here. Thanks for stopping by my channel and checking out this video. But let's go ahead and dive into the process and how you do this. All right, so the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is grab your remote and grab your iPhone, your iPad. Okay, so we're on the Roco uh, screensaver screen. We're gonna go ahead and hit home, take you to the home screen. First thing you wanna do is go over to the settings bar over here on the left-hand side. And you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you're on the latest system settings software. So you're gonna to go to system and you're gonna to go to system update right there. Now, as you can see, I am on 9.2.1 uh, is what I'm on. So that's the latest on this one as of today. Um, I just um, up or got this installed. So that's the latest software update as according to this video. So you want to make sure that you update now um, and make sure you're on the latest system update. All right, so next you're going to want to go. Now, let me take you back home as if you were doing this from the beginning. Go back home, go to settings. Okay, go down to system. And then you're gonna go over here to screen mirroring. And then click over. All right, so it takes you to the screen mirroring. Over here on the right hand side, you'll see where it says prompt. Uh, so that way when a device tries to cast your TV or screen, a prompt on your TV screen will ask you to confirm. Or you can go to always allow. Uh, so that when a device tries to cast your TV screen, it will automatically be connected or you can go to never allow. So uh, what we're trying to achieve on this is to screen mirroring. So we want either prompt or always al allow. <clears throat> we're gonna go ahead and select prompt. Okay, next up, you're gonna wanna go to your Apple device here. So I'm, I'm on my iPhone and let it focus in. Okay, and then download the Roco app if you haven't got that installed already. Go ahead and download that and we'll open it. Okay, now it says easily cast your photos video and audio to a connected Roco device on here. Um, just so you know, this is like the, as soon as you open it up, this is um, kind of like a home screen, but down here on the bottom right, there's media, and then that brings up this screen here, uh, mirror. So we're gonna go ahead and hit connect. Now it's recognizing that I have two different Roco um, devices in my house. So I'm gonna go to that second one there. That's my, the Roco Express Plus that I was talking about. <clears throat> so tap on that. Now it takes media on the Roco. So we're gonna go to videos. We're gonna give access, allow access to the photos and it's loading. Okay, so it's got all my photos on my phone here. So I'm just gonna pick one that I just took a random one of my cat. Um, I recorded for the purpose of this video here. So it says loading video, retrieving and voila. This is the video I took on my phone of my cat playing with a Nerf dart. And now it is projecting right here on the TV. Easy peasy. All right, so yeah, that looks pretty good. I mean, that was the short little clip that I took and it's projecting right on there. Okay, so that was a super simple way of how you can mirror your iPhone or any type of uh, Apple device to your Roco Stick TV or your Roco, your Roco TV or your Roco Stick. So hopefully this video helped you out. If it did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I make tech videos all the time and I'd love to have you back in the next one. And that's my dog. <laughs> so all right, until then, get out there guys and be creative.